Coming at you live from the Redneck Riviera, Gandy Beach, St. Petersburg, Florida. Oh yeah. because the uh, mounting brackets on the other ones uh, were broken. Uh, I need an AC condenser so that accounts for my sweaty appearance and uh, because that was behind the mangled bumper. But I've already got a bumper picked out and it's pretty cool looking. Gonna replace the rear bumper as well. Something a little more aggressive and uh, non-stock. Uh, but she's running good. Check it out. So here's what we've got. The bumper is off. All the supports for the bumper are, are straightened out. The radiator support bracket mount is replaced. The radiator is replaced because of the uh, attachment points were damaged. This little thing in the front here is a transmission cooler and it's a little bit misshapen. I'm gonna see if I can flatten it out because uh, the AC condenser goes behind that between the radiator and the transmission cooler here and there. Um, I've also taken a look at uh, some new hoods because my hood is a little funny shaped right now uh, and the grill is trashed so I'll replace that eventually. Uh, I've got a bumper in mind. It's pretty cool. It's an off-road bumper. Uh, with a winch mount, uh, so that'll be cool. What I'm gonna have to do is get the individual broken pieces of my winch uh, replaced. Fortunately, I believe the uh, company Warren sells each and every component of that winch, so I can replace the broken pieces, strap it into the new bumper, and go from there. Uh, and then I was also looking at a rear bumper to replace the uh, standard stock rear bumper. Something that looks a little more aggressive. Um, maybe uh, with a swingway tire carrier and uh, a fuel tank or a couple of tire carriers, I don't know. Always nice to have some spares. This is the replacement AC condenser. Um, so I'm just gonna do it myself. Like I said, it sandwiches in between the, the uh, radiator and then we're gonna recharge it with some AC recharging stuff. Basically, we're just gonna hope for the best. Now, we're gonna relax a little bit. I actually rode it to work yesterday, and despite the fact that the, uh, the uh, what do you call them? The plastic uh, mud guards in the wheel wells were rubbing off one of the tires. Uh, everything else is good. So, and that was just because the wind pushed it back. 